So that's what happened with the water. Now, with the fire, is something totally amazing in itself because the devastation of the fire is also in reverse. Y'all been burnt up, every last one of you. Whether you choose to believe it or not, you were already in hell's fire. All that fire you seen going on with all the smoke and brimstone had already overtook you. But what you seen in reverse was you guys fleeing the fire and it looked like the fire had started. But when actuality, y'all came out of the, f God brought and delivered you from the pits of hell because you are already ash burnt. Just like the white ground that you see in some of these pictures where it had gotten just so hot, that's where you were at. You were of the ashes. That's what God said, ashes to ashes, dust to dust. He brought you back from the ashes, back up into the dust that you are, and you guys were fleeing in a backwards way. You came out the fire backwards, thinking that you were running and evacuating, okay? when the fire had already took you and then everything you see was everything as far as the firefighters fighting it and you have to look at it as reverse. Instead of the water coming out the holes, the water went up into the holes. Then all you guys were traveling backwards coming up about the fire and the ash and the pits of the fire of hell and brimstone and he brought you back up into a flesh of dirt when you were ash. And he brought you back up out the ash, back up into dirt, you and all your family, and you put your clothes back up, and your skin came back up onto your body, and you were, because you were of the valley of the dry bones, and the ashes, the ashes, and he brought you back up in reverse mode. And now you're fleeing, and some of you got the, the nerve to still hate him after he just brought you back from Hell's Fire's pit. But you don't even know it, because you just thought that the fire came through and just did it. No, the fire had got you. And it took you guys, probably when you were asleep in your containment fields on those computers, and the fire came and burnt y'all all up a long time ago. And God loved you so much that he didn't want you to stay in that ash pit. And so he reverse time tra traveled you guys back up from the ashes of hell and turned you back into flesh. And now you had a lot of you, when you got back into the flesh, you still started to disobey him after he just delivered you from hell's fire pit. And that's where the virus came. And then the virus came because he set you free again from the pits of hell and you still didn't want to believe him, in him and follow him. So now he has to take you back from dust to dust, back up into the ash again. Ashes to ashes, dust to dust again, because he's revoking and taking the breath of life out of you and that's why you're dying of a respiratory disease because God brought you back from the pits of hell and you still couldn't understand what had happened to you. And then when you got and he brought you back out of hell, a lot of you wanted to go right back up into the sin because you came out in reverse mode and you went right back up into sin again. And so he killed you and is killing you now with the virus. He's revoking the breath of life out of you. You have to love God and serve God. For it's he that delivers us from the pits of hell. And we have no idea how deep in hell we were. 
But when we came up out and you look at and you see the ash and all the brimstone and the fire around that had consumed you guys, and he loved you that much, he brought you back in reverse mode, and when you got back up, what'd you do? Just like in the day of Moses, you rebelled on him again. Transmission out.